Hey guys, again welcome back to our channel Dev Town. As guys, in this previous video, we have discussed about the AQI quality. Okay, and we have get the insight from the data, and we have also like plot this the graph as you can see on the screen by which we can easily understand which country is having the like bad quality index air okay and which is having a good so now what we are gonna do in this today's video today we i also have one more data it is also containing the air quality okay air quality information so let just simply start let me create a new file here okay so this is our previous video file so now we will make a new file let me rename this file to the air quality yeah perfect so the guys first step is like uh, as usual we are doing we have to import our libraries which is c bond as sn wait a second sns and the second library is numpy okay so now let me import the libraries okay now we have created all the libraries like imported now what we will do we will as usual we will give it a data wait a second okay so pd dot read and underscore csv it is a csv file guys okay and all these file i will uh, provide you in my github link i will share you guys okay so now we have given it a file and df is equal to the set dot perfect guys so now what we have to now I have I want to see the head of my file to know is it perfectly working or not okay guys so this is the output which I am getting okay so it is containing all the details and the stain code everything the state like you can see on the Pradesh and the location agency SO2 percentage okay so we are having all the data in this so now what we will do we will get the some info from it so what we have to do df.info okay guys uh, like now you would be thinking i have uh, added this encoding so suppose if you like run a file and it gives you an error let me show you how now if i run this file see guys it is giving me an error okay that utf8 code i can't decode by it okay so this is an error so this can be resolved so you just have to add a comma after it and you have to add this encoding and let in one okay so this file will run successfully as you can see on the screen okay and now we are what we are getting we are getting all the info okay that stn code state like how many state are there and the data type okay and for the sot is telling that it is a float it is also giving us the memory usage it will like guys give us all the information the basic information which our data is carrying in it and now the other operation what we will do with this data so df dot is null dot sum okay wait a second i have to add this if i run this okay so i am getting this data the sum now guys we will do some of the more operations let me show you 
okay so i have created the replacement for the state okay so this will not much effect and let me show you what i will do we'll get a agency here and after that dot okay, guys basically this is all based on the panda seaboard and numpy and uh, I have like told you the three earlier okay so uh, we are getting this the like information given by like Maharashtra State Pollution Control Board Uttar Pradesh and Andhra Pradesh Himachal Punjab okay so this these are the information given by them I hope that this thing is very much clear I, the file I will provide you in my github link and now we will do one more thing okay so now i'm we are getting the residential rural and other areas okay so i have used this type here to get this so this data is containing all like the sensitive area number industrial residential okay now like moving uh, towards the graph so the first step is we have to delete all the null attributes okay because in this data there are many null attributes and I have told you how you can delete it or remove it from the data so it is very simple df dot guys I have told you this thing earlier how you can do this it is very easy thing okay so you have to give it a zero and you have to use the subset here okay in which you will do a single this okay guys now let us copy paste this now we have to change here the and here we will add so2 so now what will this program will do this will remove all the null attributes which are having in the graph because this will definitely give us an error when we are plotting it in a graph now what we have to do here is df dot okay and we have to fire on this see we have run this program earlier also and you can see the difference okay so it is showing us more value like sampling data is 3 here and here it is 0 so now what we have done we have like removed all the empty values or the null values from our data which would definitely give us an error when we will be further programming okay so now what we have to do there are several people who are not interested in the agency okay so in this data so we will remove them here okay so what we will do we will use the df attribute here okay we use the agency here delete dot df location underscore monitoring okay I hope that till here there is no issue and we will delete this from here also
okay now we have to remove the sampling date okay so now if i process this it is showing us a invalid syntax so now what we have done wrong now this is our data set after like deleting the above columns so this is like looking very much clean data so now we will cover the next part of this uh, data in the next video okay guys i hope that you like this video and please subscribe to our channel devtown